Samsung's next major software upgrade, One UI 8.5, is turning out to be far more significant than expected, while the name might suggest a small mid-year refresh. Recent leaks revealed that this update is built on Android 16 QP or 2, which is a newer and more advanced version of Android. This means One UI 8.5 isn't just a minor patch, it's a major evolution that will reshape how Samsung phones feel and perform, according to a detailed report from Android Authority. The leaked build of One UI 8.5 carries the SDK version 36, 1 inch and the build ID prefix BP for A. Both of these match Google's Android 16 QP R2 framework, confirming that Samsung has upgraded its foundation in simpler terms. One UI 8.0 was based on the first release of Android 16, while this new version builds on the second major quarterly update, offering deeper optimizations and better overall performance. This change opens the door for several major improvements. Users can expect a mix of Google's latest Android features along with Samsung's own software enhancements. The result could be a smoother, smarter, and more customizable Galaxy experience than ever before. Let's begin with design and usability upgrades. Android 16 QP R2 introduced an expanded dark theme, which integrates more deeply across apps and menus. With One UI 8.5, that means a more uniform, eye-friendly appearance throughout the interface. Another much-needed feature, forced app icon theming, ensuring every icon matches the system color palette even if the developer hasn't updated their app. This will finally make Samsung's home screens look clean and consistent. Another. Exciting addition is native lock screen widget support for third-party apps. Until now, only Samsung's own widgets were supported natively. With One UI 8.5, users could add widgets like Spotify controls, calendar events, or fitness stats directly to the lock screen. It's a simple feature, but one that greatly enhances personalization and convenience. Health-conscious users are also getting some attention, thanks to Google's Health Connect. One UI 8.5 will likely support native step tracking and data sensing across multiple fitness apps. Whether someone uses Samsung Health, Fitbit, or Strava, all fitness information can now be viewed in one unified space for better tracking accuracy. Samsung is also focusing on finer control over user experience. The update could introduce granular haptic feedback options, allowing users to adjust vibration strength for different types of notifications and interactions. Another productivity. Boost may come in the form of built-in PDF annotation and editing, so users can sign or mark documents without needing third-party tools. Audio performance is also receiving a big leap forward. Samsung and Google are collaborating on Eclipse Audio, powered by IAMF technology, which was showcased earlier at CES 2025. This feature promises immersive, realistic audio experiences, especially when paired with Galaxy Buds or other high-end Samsung devices. In addition, users may soon get manual brightness control for HDR and SDR content, giving more flexibility for watching videos or editing photos. Personal audio sharing in the output switcher is another handy touch, letting users share sound with nearby devices or friends effortlessly. For creators and professionals, One UI 8.5 could introduce new audio AP is that improve audio processing for music production and editing apps. Enhancing creative workflows directly from a smartphone on the security and privacy front, Samsung appears to be strengthening protection layers significantly. The update might include Google's secure lock device feature, which makes it more difficult for thieves to access or reset a stolen phone. A phone theft protection toggle could allow remote locking or tracking, even after a factory reset. Meanwhile, expanded identity check will improve verification for sensitive apps, making banking and authentication processes much safer. However, not every feature from Android 16 QP R2 may make it into One UI 8.5. Samsung typically picks the most stable and relevant updates for its ecosystem. Even so, users will still benefit from improved apps, performance enhancements, and the latest security patches that come with the Android base update. In essence, one UI 8.5 could be one of Samsung's biggest mid-cycle updates to date. It's not just about visual polish, it's about integrating deeper Android functionality, improving customization, enhancing productivity, and elevating overall device performance. Everything will be officially unveiled with the Galaxy S26 series, which is expected to launch with One UI 8.5 pre-installed once it rolls out. Galaxy users will finally see just how much Samsung's software has evolved. 
Combining the best of Android 16 QPR2 with Samsung's own ecosystem refinements. In summary, One UI 8.5 is shaping up to deliver a smoother interface, smarter tools, better sound, improved customization, and stronger security. What seemed like a regular update could easily become one of the most polished and feature-rich versions of Samsung's software ever released.